Okay, so I just wanna show you some tips. So I've got a piece of paper here and I have four different boxes on. I'm gonna do two different things in each box just to show you. So we'll start with this one. And this is looking at ways of blending the oil pastels, taking it from one color to the other. So this is our oil pastel. We just need to take a bit of scrap paper first and clean it off to make sure that I don't have any other colors on it. So I'll scribble that off. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Okay. So I'll just start with the red, yellow, and blue. So these primary colors will help us. So the first thing you can do is think about painting with the painting with oil pastels. So oil pastels are a really nice transition between um, paints and pastels. So they've got more of like a, a weight to them that you'd see in paint, but still got kind of the ease of use of a um, pencil crane or something like that. So by overlapping them here, you can see, you can still see both colors, but you're starting to blend those together. Another way you can do it is if we do a circle going from one side to the other, and then I lighten this off as I go here, and then I get my, my red that I want to blend it with. And I go darker, press on this side. So the more I press on, the darker and the more solid the color is. And then the lighter I press, the more it blends. So I can overlap the two of these. And by overlapping them, you see there's a smoother transition. <laughs> yeah? So here you've got both of them still visible, but making, we've got a green making there, we've got a purple making there. Here we've overlapped it to make those that smoother blend, okay? Say I wanted to make a lighter colour. So I only have this blue in my set and I want to make it lighter. I can put the blue down and then I take a lighter colour like the white and I could overlap it like we just saw here. Or for example, if I didn't want it that light, but I wanted it just a little bit lighter, I could use a gray. So I can change the color and I can layer a few colors together to mix a different color, yeah? If I say wanted to make this blue darker and I didn't have another blue, I could take a darker shade like my black. Now just as a heads up, your black will kill any color that you've got. So it will take away um, from the light in that color. But there you can see we've made a dark colour. You could also adjust the hue slightly. So by overlapping the green and that blue, you can change the colour that way as well. So that's one way that you can make it darker. Now notice that when it when I get a bit of excess, I don't move my hand across. Because can you see there it if you go get your hand across it, it creates these like marks and smudges. So we don't want to do that. So if I go over here, we're looking at layering again in two different ways that we can layer. Now this one's one of my favorites. So I'm just gonna clean my oil pastel again. So this is called Scraffito. So I'll go over with a light color 
And then over the top, I go in with a darker colour. Nice and simple. And then I use a stick to to scratch away. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to tap it or get a dry brush, a nice clean dry brush and just wipe that away. I don't want to push it away with my hands or press down too hard because it will smudge. So the other thing you can do is scumble. So if you want a more of a visual texture, this is basically just scribbling. See a scribble, 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 and that overlaps them, and that kind of creates a nice bit of a visual texture, a bit of a visual blend. I'll get rid of the excess there again, just with a light brush. Now the last two are the two other ways to blend. Um, so I'll blend my yellow in again. So I'll get my yellow here and I'll press lightly with my tissue sorry with my red there and then I'll do the same on this one below so we can just show you at the same time how they work so I'm going to get a bit of kitchen roll or toilet roll and I'm just gonna just lift this up. I'm just gonna fold this around and make a point. So you can use tissue paper to blend these together together. And it almost sands off the top surface. Be careful that you don't get any of the colour in there. The other way you can do it is using your finger. Now this might be the one that you think is the easiest. But if you use your finger, you've got to make sure that your finger's clean. And then once you've done it, you clean your finger again. So if I rub here and blend it together but it starts to smudge a lot more around the outside because the oil from my fingertip is moving that around as well so here are a few different ways that you can use the oil pastels make it lighter or make it darker by layering the colors up on top overlap the colors to make a blend Swirl them in together. You can blend them using tissue paper or your fingers. I recommend tissue paper. I hate finger blending. <laughs> and then you can also scratch into the oil pastels or scumble it. Hope you enjoy.